I've heard before that it takes three installments in a series to know if you're interested in it, and I'm here to test that out. Hey everyone, Skull902 here, and this is Rule of Three. The only episode of Batch Number 3 that wasn't a suggestion, today on Rule of Three I'll be looking at Reboot. In what may be the first fully CG animated series on television, this Canadian production was broadcast on YTV between 1994 and 2001, airing in the US on ABC and, later on, Cartoon Network's Toonami Block. This is yet another show I have foggy memories of as a child, so it'll be nice to see and get a clear picture of it here. It's been on my bucket list for a while now. As mentioned before, this was a groundbreaking show on the visual side of things, but for all its technical feats, does it hold up as a whole? Here's my take on it. The show's soundtrack is serviceable enough, but doesn't really have any themes I thought were memorable. As far as the voice acting goes, I don't really recall any bad performances and the characters' voices all sound good, especially the legendary Tony J as Megabyte. When it comes to the visuals, it does some pretty impressive stuff for the time. Obviously some animations are going to look jank by today's standards, but you gotta remember that this was one of the earliest attempts at a CGI series. Considering that, I think they did a commendable job creating this visually interesting world. Not to mention I'm just a fan of the early CG look and feel. The character designs are all pretty good too. Hexadecimal in particular I thought came off as appropriately intimidating. The only character I didn't really think looked completely right was Megabyte. Lastly, the writing. Much like the last episode, it felt kinda standard. Nothing super good or super bad. Some things felt a little weak, such as the second episode's plot being driven entirely by idiocy or how the restaurant workers followed Bob into the game in the third. Nitpicking, perhaps, but Bob also seems like too much of an everyman name for a fictional action hero, too. Could've gone with something different there. Aside from that, I like the idea of putting the characters into various computer games to fight their enemies, and having the characters Bob hangs around to help him out in these games I thought was a good move too. And now the verdict. I hate to say it again, but I don't think Reboot did enough to leave me wanting more. Again, it's not a bad show, but much like the last couple things I looked at, it really is just okay more than anything in my opinion. It's a pretty standard show for the time, even if its animation gives it a significant place in history. That's the end for this episode of Rule of Three. Hopefully the next episode yields some better results, since it's the last one in this bunch. For now, I've been Skull902, thank you for watching, and have yourselves a wonderful day.